Level one. All right, team. Command is giving me the orders. We got a rescue mission. You're up first, Bazinga. Followed by you, Ben. Followed by you, Q. You guys ready for this? Yeah. Get yeah. psyched. Yeah. Go down. Yeah. Team, get tacked. Get, get tacked. Whoa. 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 That didn't sound good, guys. No. Yup, yup, Ben. You gotta get, you gotta go find him and bring him back, man. Come on. I guess. Come on, All get right. that excitement going. Come on, get tech. Get tech. Get you. Come on. Just cover the door while he's gone. Come on. Ah! Shit, that's two down, dude. You gonna do something about this, man? Come on. Come on, man. Get, get on. I'm gonna handle it. Don't you worry. Go. Put the coffee oh. down and go. Two get tech. Oh, shit! Die! You son of a... Q? Zynga? Ben? Sir, Team the attack has been annihilated. What do I do? No. They took all the weapons, sir. I don't have a... Damn it! What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another Get Tech Game Smash. I'm Grim. This is Observer Q and Benzingo over there. And off camera is my boy Ben, who's going to take in when we get to him. We're playing Zero Tolerance. First person shooter from the Sega Genesis era with a unique system. It allowed you to play co-op using two systems linked together through a system I don't freaking remember. All right. <coughs> so the story basically is your uh, combat team sent to a merchant vessel to find out what's happened on it yeah each one of these guys has a different specialty which means they start with different types of weapons i'm not sure what weapons they are but i'm not going to take the marksman because i know he probably wants a marksman so i'm going to go with tony Roma Ramos. For first person shooter first yeah. person shooter interesting so yeah so what really happened here is that okay we went and colonized most of the solar system but on some of the outer rim planets one of our vessels was attacked randomly so the planet defense force kicked in and sent their special elite force in to go to handle the problem. And just that's who we are. That controls down now. That's who we are. Trying to save the planet that we just colonized. Yeah, we are elite. I mean, I don't know if you figured this out yet. <laughs> Hashtag being the elite. Uh, now, this game must have came out after Wolfenstein. Ah, um, uh, yes. Yeah, I'll say. So this came out. Um, the only other two games that came out on the Sega was Duke Nukem and Bloodthirst, I think it was. The other game, there was only two like Bloodthirster. There was only two other Duke first person. Nuka came out on the Sega. Yeah, no. And I will tell you, because you're playing an old game, it does suck. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Did come out in '94 though. There was a lot of great games that came out in '94. You can tell from our past game smash. Yeah. You hear that year a lot. For some reason. Nukem 3D Mega Drive. Oh yep. damn! Is that real though? Yes. <laughs> I, I Is that real, real though? Wiki. Like really? That's the wiki. <laughs> It must have been garbage. <laughs> Make sure you pay attention to the sound effects. Oh wow, the voices. Because it basically you're gonna hear the guns cock when you when you trigger someone. See? Say hello to my little friend. Oh shit. Uh oh. So it didn't come out in America, that's why. That's why I didn't think it came, it was on the Sega. It wasn't uh, on the Sega. Did I forget to uh, mention this game controls terrible? It was on the Mega Drive. It was on the control stick. It was on the Sega Mega. Sega Mega. I spent a lot of time playing this game. It's got 40 floors, limited supplies in the way of healing and stuff. Oh yeah, yeah. And not getting hit is kind of impossible. Oh yeah, I've watched some crazy speedruns of this game. Like not getting hit is really just impossible. You're gonna take damage. So it's about mitigating how much you take. All right, so this guy's clearly the shotgun, dude. Got a lot of dead bodies there, but... Oh, oh no! Uh-oh. Oh. oh! It runs pretty smooth. Yeah, it, it's actually very good for a Sega 
first person shooter. Really low. No, that was telling me that my health is getting kind of low. Uh oh. Oh, I thought you were out of ammo. I got my fist, fool. Oh, you got got. <laughs> Back when FPS is, didn't have to worry about aiming. This is excellent battlegrounds training. <laughs> you, there's a lot of people. I'd like to get past the first floor, but I don't know. If no, are these guys these guys are supposed to be aliens? No, aliens show up later. Ah, uh, okay. This is like you're here to. It's like a hostage situation that turns into an alien situation. Oh, okay. I think they used a little too much of uh, the screen real estate on other things. <laughs> yeah, I'll give you that. But like, that's probably because they couldn't get it to run well. Oh, yeah, I think it's possible. Because, you know, Weasel's license did not have to be that large. <laughs> it's bigger than the map. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't need to see that. <laughs> it's very true. Very true. Major T. Romos. All right, man, suck four. Just random light somewhere. Ah, every now and then you gotta try and you know make it look cooler. Yeah. Oh crap! Yeah, I don't know. I'm I'm really wondering that. I'll uh oh. Look, I'll <laughs> look into the detail because Duke Nukem when I played this, ah! um, it took up the full screen. T. Romos is dead. Uh, so I think it was. All just, right. I think it was just bad designing. Go ahead and pick another uh, character. Well, you have to understand the the Genesis was not as good as Super Nintendo. Psycho. So the the thing that Sega had on it was the the sound was better, right? Yeah. On a lot of things. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I like the Sega. You get bulletproof vest, which I find hilarious. Explain to me oh. why does the guy who's the master of combat not get a bulletproof vest, but the marksman who's not supposed to ever get shot at not get the <laughs> right? Oh yeah. yeah. Elevator key. Like I said, I've been like 30 up levels of this game. I've never beaten it. Wow. It's uh, it's rough. It gets much harder. I was goofing around right there. I could have kept myself alive much longer, but then I would have hit a point, point where I was just getting destroyed. Oh. It's so nice Ooh. of them to let you know they're coming with a <laughs> every time. <laughs> All right, guys, we're not going to cock or load our guns until he's in sight. There he is! <laughs> if you think that's a lot, there'll be rooms with 30, with like 20 people running around at you. Nate, you're blowing through a lot of that shotgun ammo. It's funny how every room more. just has this giant window. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I never said the game was perfect, but for Sega Genesis, I had a blast. Oh yeah, I'm very impressed. And I took forever playing, like I, cause I couldn't oh, beat it, so it was like a year of just playing it. Yeah, what amazing! The fact that has audio, uh, audio, like voice audio. I feel like the only reason why first-person shooters became a success back then was out of okay, stubbornness. That, because that if you look at them now, it's like, yeah, Doom was cool, but it wasn't playable. Doom was like th this is not playable no, for a no. first-person shooter. These controls are terrible. This is how Doom was on the computer too. Yeah, you used the arrow buttons, didn't you? Yeah, mm -hmm. it was fun. I loved it, especially on Tamina. I know that's what's weird. I feel like it was a stubborn like I'm gonna I'm gonna just learn how to use these controls and enjoy it for these controls because yeah. Well, there was also no aiming either. Just yeah, just left and right, no up and down. You're good. Oh, okay. I just think first person shooters are one of those types of games that have evolved to the point where this would never work now. Of course not. But well but no like certain games would. Like you could make a Mario world all over again and be fine. Brutal Doom is pretty popular. Yeah, well, but that's a nostalgia thing. Yeah, but it's fun though. <laughs> like if, if like they said we're making a Call of Duty with a mode like this, people are like, oh the mode's cool, then they wouldn't play it. Oh you yeah. son of a That is impressive too. You see the way the, the wall's cracking when he shoots it? Yeah, yeah. Like, a lot of this wall. is impressive for a Sega Genesis game. Uh oh. Oh, who the hell's shooting at me? The bulletproof vest is gone. Uh oh. Yeah. There's like four of them dude, in there. You're getting wrecked. Use the radar. Oh. They're behind you, bro. Oh. Oh, oh no. My turn. Looks like, looks like we'll make it to the swap before we know it. Major Jerp. jerp. Get a jerp. They took my jerp. No, I don't want to. <laughs> no, no, no. Go. Damn it. Go, I, back. Go, 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 go back. I love the elevator music. I'm sorry. 
Also, there's no benefit to killing all the all the guys on the floor, except that you can freely then look around without being worried about being killed. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, so the, yeah, the, 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 this is exactly how I thought the controls would be. They lag. It's like they swig. Yeah. 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 All right. So you got like ten dudes out there, man. Get hype! Go get them! <laughs> Who's this freaking Conan? They're alien warriors. Well, that guy. No, they're the same exact guy that you've killed 14 times already. <laughs> yeah, he's just close. He's got a big Holy Moses. Yeah, that's the room I ran, remember? With the shotgun, I was just blocking. Damn, you murder machine. <laughs> Ammo collected. Well, there's nobody else in here. Ammo collected. So room clear, boss. Room clear. <laughs> I'm saying a new orders just came down. Well, they want you to not to do get killed. Go away. Dude, you guys got such a hardcore, like, 50s hairstyle. Like, he's a soldier from a 50s movie. Yeah. Meow. Meow. I think the demolition guy has like a grenade. Wait, this is close to where I died. It's like a few rooms up. No, he's past where you died because the guys would be dead if he. If he no, no, because this is the room because I'm under the health pack that can pick them yeah, up. Yeah, but you, 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 it's not a respawn, right? Yeah, they don't respawn. It's oh, a, okay. It's a. Oh, uh, shit, I'm out of gun. One hit point left. Oh, no. Ah! All right, man, swap in the, the big B. I'm here to kick ass and chew some celery. And I'm, all out, and I'm all out of bubble gum. <laughs> and success. He did not go down the elevator, folks. Things are looking <laughs> up. I learned from people's mistakes. He's got a mine. That's his specialty. I can drop a mine that no one's ever going to walk on. And this dude just looks pissed, man. See, man, got the idea. You move slowly until you hear like, and then you kill the one that moved, and then you move up again. That's how it works. I was just trying to die so he could play. Shut up. <laughs> that, that's exactly what I did. I got to the second floor. I was like, I'm just going to run in this room and get got. Because it doesn't get hard till like sixth or seventh floor. And then it just starts running you over. You'll see if, if, if Ben moves far enough to get down there. Oh. No aliens yet. All right, go south when you get through these doors. And go through that door down there. It's kind of hard because you're looking at the screen, but you're also I looking at the map. I think that's the elevator, but I could be wrong. Yep. Yeah, man. Team Get Tech successfully made it through three levels. Better than the intro. <laughs> oh, look, there's a med pack you could have used. Hand gun collected. Yo, is, is she like the uh Dude, go ahead and waste 14 rounds on that guy. So is this AI <laughs> like the uh ancestor to your Cortana? God no. Cortana sucks. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm gonna trigger some people right now. Uh -oh. The story in Halo was not good. <laughs> no. Oh shit. What in fact, the people who scream at me that yeah, Halo has his what? original storyline. I like to point out that the storyline of Halo is basically Aliens 2. <laughs> but it also took all the stuff from, from Aliens. I just like the flood. punched him, yeah. you know? Yeah, the flood was from Aliens, basically, and um, the the Marines were basically the Aliens from Space Marines. I mean, the Space Marines from Aliens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. Yeah. 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 It just changed the gun. It's not like there was a bad game, but I hear people talk about like, I want a story that really deems into the background of Master but Chief. He's not a character! His whole character was, I'll oh. get the job done. Oh. My co-producer just told me I got three minutes, so let's go buck wild on this shit. Do you don't have silver to go ahead and play Justin Wolf? <laughs> Dude, he's playing D&D &D with us. We Is that Kevin Bacon? His character the other day. <laughs> I put his character together the other day. Oh no, what do you do? Nothing, we're just, he's, he's gonna be um, a rogue. Okay. Oh. Hand gun collected. Hand gun collected. Wolfman. Alright, it's the Wolfman! <laughs> Madge J. <laughs> Madge J. <laughs> okay. 
Call him Kevin Bacon. My name is Vag J. Jay Walt here. Welcome to the YouTube channel. I knew you were coming. I heard it. Bandon, go like this. I knew you were coming. So, Major J. Wolf was born in 74. Ah. So I He's an old you, man. Give you a backstory where I play the game. You know, you, you get to know these characters. Like, <laughs> Dude, there's a lot of cool my, things about this game. Dude, it's my age. What the hell? There's a lot of cool things about this game. I, I'm hey, more impressed now than I was then because I re didn't remember how good it was. This is a good game. The controls are weird. Still a good game. Oh, wait. I just realized that. This is another reference. To uh, future like domination of our solar system. At one point, I'm gonna have to put together a collection. Oh, here we go! Of sci-fi stories that have the UN as ruling of the uh, our galaxy. There's a lot. So, dude, and this is just go. another one. Here we go. Let me get a big one. room. Ah! New monsters. The you aliens. got a flamethrower. Yeah. Oh, awesome. They give it a flamethrower because the monsters are showing up. And the spiders. Hey! It's screaming. You want to not... mess with Fisty? Oh, no. I'm going to fist this game up. Ugh! Ugh! Major J. Wolf don't mess around. Uh-oh. <laughs> you, you, you are definitely wounded. I can kick if I back up! <laughs> oh shit. Oh. Did you want to mess with me? Oh, you're being oh. booted, fool! I lied. There's a rip holster to the damn wall. What the hell? <laughs> Alright. It's coming out of your paycheck. So that is zero tolerance. There's a lot more to it. Maybe I'll stream it one of these days. But. I don't know. What do you guys think? This is a really good game. It was definitely of its era with Duke Nukem and Doom. It definitely did what it needed to do to compete. What? Super map! <laughs> I didn't know there was another map. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Check out any other Get Tech stuff. And see you next time. Remember to like, comment, and hit that bell to get a little notification when our next video goes live. Thank you for watching. Join us next time.